Welcome back to our studios here at the Copacabana Beach. It is past midnight here in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, but everyone is still pumping. There's still some action going on. But you know, there is no party without Usain Bolt, of course. We know <laughs> the Jamaican, everyone is waiting to see him in action here at the Rio Olympics. And he's been having some fun himself, though. Nice way of preparing there with some samba ladies. This was him at a press conference in Rio earlier today. And as I asked before, who's luckier, Bolt or the ladies? I can't answer yeah, that question. Yeah, no, it hasn't been the perfect uh, season, but uh, I'm in much better shape. Uh, I've gotten a lot more races in. Uh, I, w I was really unhappy about not competing on my trials because I needed those runs. But um, I've been training well, executing well in training. My coach is happy, so that's the key thing. So everything is going smoothly. Championships. Uh, as a young kid, you grow up looking forward to the big games. And I think over the years, I've just really gotten into it. Um, championships are what matters. So for me, I always work towards these championships and try and do my best here. And I always come out here and I give it 150% always. I think I, I'm more nervous over 200 meters than anything else, for some reason. I always get nervous. That's the one we never think you're going to lose. Yeah, I yeah, know, but for some reason, I always <laughs> get nervous. But for the one it's never really that stressful. I know my weakness. I know where I'm weakest, and I know where I'm strongest. So for me, it's all about just getting it right, and I'll be fine. But for some reason, when I get to the 200 meters, I'm always a little bit nervous right throughout the rounds from the day I start to the, the finals. Because like, you love that nervous. one the most? Yeah, yeah. I definitely think so.